in Saudi Arabia, Almarai, the largest integrated dairy business in the world, has seven farms producing a billion litres of milk per year. We've come to their Al Badaya farm, 46,000 dairy animals, 22,500 milking cows. What an operation. Milk is what it's all about at Al Badaya, 930,000 litres a day. So let's take a look at the milking operation and how it's achieved. So you have rapid exit, 75 unit double up parlours, 75 cows at each side, clusters, automatic trough screws, look over my shoulder, another 75 cows at each side. So there's three of those stations with double up parlours at each side. We visited in October 2013, uh, the cows were averaging 42 litres per cow per day, so 13,400 litres per cow per year. Staff, 698 men working on Albedia. 14 different nationalities. It's a military style operation, as you can imagine, in terms of milking these cows four times per day. So they're fed an hour and a half before milking, checked, attention to detail. Then in the parlor, there's a computerized system to monitor individual cow records each day. So you have a microchip in the cow's leg and you can monitor her yield. And if there's any variation, you can know there's a problem. The cows were in excellent condition during our visit, I would have to say. So as you look down here, just see if the cow's exiting. That's why it's called rapid exit. The gate lifts up at the front, 75 cows walk out. So immediately as soon as they walk out, a flush of water starts coming to clean the floor underneath the cows. The place was immaculate. The water comes from an aquifer 350 meters below the desert in Saudi Arabia. The farm is a huge user of water, as you can imagine, in order to keep the cows cool, and to keep the place clean. There's misters used to keep the cows at a steady 20 to 25 degrees. And I have to say, the cows looked to be in excellent condition and very comfortable. Let's take a look around the yard. Now we might speed this up because this place is six kilometers long, three kilometers wide, 2,200 hectares, about a third of it under buildings. A lot of buildings like this. This one is where the heifers are kept. It runs to 900 meters long, so we won't go through it all in detail. The heifers are bred at an average of 13 months, calving down at 23 months of age, once they're at target weight of 400 kilograms at breeding. Alfalfa hay is the main feed at al -Badaya. It comes from Northern Saudi Arabia, it comes from Spain, it comes from Ukraine. 52 feed bunkers, seven trucks working 20 hours a day to keep all the animals fed. It's a massive operation. The calf sheds. Let's have a look at the calf housing. All heifer calves at Albadi are retained. Bull calves are sold at about 10 days of age. Look at these calf huts as far as the eye can see. The herd is growing at between 6 and 7% per year. They do use some sex semen during the cooler winter months. So that's a quick overview of Albadi. Our thanks to Almarai Management for facilitating a visit by the Irish Farmers Journal. Amazing farm, Albadi, 930,000.